You would not be able to lose the bets today if you thought the Yellowstone Expanded Universe of series couldn't possibly get any more perplexing. David Oilo and Dennis Quaid will appear in 1883 The Bass Reeves Story. Is it the conclusion of a prequel? Bass Reeves wasn't actually a man. Yes, and again, I'll do my best to explain Bass Reeves, so buckle up, because this one's a bit of a challenge. Be with us as we ride through the videos, keep watching as we talk about everything in regards to Yellowstone spin-off Bass Reeves. Hey, before we talk in detail about the Yellowstone spin-off Bass Reeves, leave us a subscription and press the bell icon. The new prequel, 1883, has been approved. Yellowstone, which is set at the moment, chronicles the Dutton family as they fight to defend the biggest ranch in America against hedge firms and governmental entities that want to acquire their family's ancestral land. A prequel miniseries named 1883 was given the go-ahead by Paramount after it turned into one of the most watched television programs. In 1883, which starred Tim McGraw and Faith Hill, the first Dutton friends and family were shown crossing the Oregon Trail and settling in Montana, the location of the series Yellowstone Ranch. Apart from that, 1883 was mostly a standalone production. About any of them, Sheridan said to reporters, I don't consider that they qualify as spin-offs, instead seeing them as full storylines with shared origins. With the subsequent film, I want you to be able to have never visited Yellowstone or 1883. While maintaining a completely realized sequence as a viewer, the director said, It turned out that the following program would be in 1923, starring Harrison Ford and Helen Mirren. Although it is a precursor to a successor, Yellowstone is not necessary to view and appreciate. How about Bass Reeves then? Now, when Sheridan concluded 1883, the Paramount Network's producers were furious because he had written it so that a second season was impossible. They planned to convene a conference to talk about how particular characters might have survived their deaths, but Sheridan came up with another glimpse inside the window. Instead, as she previously told Deadline, since we already picked it up, they were like, there better be a fucking season two, he recounted. I'm saying, guys, everyone is dead as I sit here. The Bass Reeves story will provide another window into that time period. There is just one problem. Bass Reeves isn't a wholly unique creation. He was indeed a real-life gunslinger and lawman who lived from 1838 to 1910, and it's estimated that during his lifespan he made over 3,000 arrests. Many historians think that Reeves served as the lone range partial's influence, so the semi-biographical television series based on a real person will be a part of the Yellowstone series? The program's title was last revealed as 1883 The Best Reeves Story in May 2022. It's very feasible that by the time it airs, the show's Yellowstone's connections will have diminished, leaving us with a Bass Reeves program that is wholly unrelated to Yellowstone. Demi Singleton has been chosen as the cast member of the 1883. The ensemble for Taylor Sheridan's upcoming western film, 1883 The Bass Reeves Story, is expanding. Demi Singleton is the most recent cast member for the show. According to reporters, she'll make a regular appearance in the series alongside David Ilo, who portrays the lead lawman. Dennis Quaid, Barry Pepper, Forrest Goodluck, Lauren E. Banks, and Grantham Coleman are among the actors in Singleton's cast. Sally, the precocious daughter of Bass Reeves and Jenny Banks, will be portrayed by Singleton. It will be the most recent position in Singleton's flourishing career. With Forrest Whitaker, she also appeared in the MGM Plus series Godfather of Harlem. She gained fame in movies for playing a young Serena Williams in the Academy Award-winning movie King Richard. What would be the storyline of the Yellowstone spin-off Bass Reeves? Reeves, a frontier lawman who is regarded as the greatest frontier hero in American history and provided the basis for the Lone Ranger, will be featured in the series for its fabled adventures. As a tangent to the prequel series, 1883, Reeves' story will have a connection to Sheridan's Yellowstone. The year 1883 was the turning point in the Dutton family's journey from Yellowstone to Montana, where they established the ranch that serves as the centerpiece of their narrative. 1923, a different Yellowstone prequel, occurs a generation after the events in 1883. The Dutton family is the main subject of that series, which stars Harrison Ford and Helen Mirren as they deal with difficulties during the Prohibition era. The first season of this show was completed, and a second season was presently in process. To stay updated about your favorite show, subscribe and press the bell icon, also like and share our videos.